meet and greet. I have to share this with you. Many, many a people take the meet and greet for granted. Why is that? Because they think it's the simplest thing in the world. Well, let me tell you, it is one of the most important. I say this because it involves impressionism. Your first impression is everything. You must also incorporate humor, laughter. It is contagious. It is also known as a cure-all. The impression you make when you first approach. The meet and greet is your approach to the couple you have in front of you. Example. Good morning, Mr. And Mrs. Jones. My name is Rui, Rui Vieira, and you are? And they will give you your names, their names. And let me share something about names. The most beautiful sound to an individual's ear is their own name. So don't you ever forget a name. Not only the husband and the wife, but most important, the children. But there's a formula to never forgetting the name. Say it three times, spell it three times, and as soon as you have an opportunity, you use it in conversation. Follow that formula and you will never forget a name. That if you come across an odd name, how do you remember that? First question out of your mouth should be, wow, interesting name, never heard it before. Can you spell it for me, please? And they will respect you for that. Impressionism. That could mean a lot of things. But when it comes to the meet and greet, it's the little things that many of us miss that can make a world of a difference. What am I referring to? Number one, both men and women, your attire. Is it neat? Is it pressed? Do you have a professional look about you? Your hygiene. Are your nails manicured? Is your hair well done? Do you have sweet breath? All this makes a tremendous impact. You have to think about and question what is their mindset? Who's to say that they didn't have a bad experience in the past? And your approach during that meet and greet could make a world of a difference. Your personality must come out. And if you're in this industry, you have an awesome personality. You're an outgoing person. You're not afraid to talk to people. You can start a conversation instantly. And this is what the meet and greet is about. Introducing yourself, getting to know them, who they are, where they came from, and so forth. At this point, you should be escorting your family to your station where you will begin the second stage, which is the warm up. What is the warm-up designed to do? The warm-up is designed to get them to like you and trust you. But how is that done? There's one common thread. It's called commonality. You must find a common thread with them. Stay with us. In the next segment, you will be introduced to a warm-up like you've never seen before.